you have to Thank be praying in the spirit at all times on every occasion, whether it's good or bad, no matter what's going on. Because remember, you don't see what's going on. Everything that happens, it happens in the spirit realm first. That's why he said, if you bind it, if you take authority over it here on earth, uh -huh. it's going to be bound in heaven. And you need to stay alert uh -huh. and be persistent in your prayers. Because when you do that, you are able to bind things and declare that they are bound before they ever manifest in the natural. Everything happens in the spirit realm first. And we'll go over the story of Daniel and explain that. Everything happens in the spirit realm first before it happens in the natural. And actually, let's start with Cornelius first. And then we'll, because Daniel's, there's a lot to unpack in Daniel. So I want to make sure, and there's a lot of other scriptures that talk about this. In fact, the book of Colossians, one of, one of your favorite scriptures and a scripture I love too, talks about how he's, Jesus in the spirit realm, he triumphed over the enemy and he displayed yeah. to all of the wicked rulers in the unseen realm, his, wow, his you know, majesty love, and love, his I wisdom. What, I love what she just says. Uh, maybe somebody's asking a question. What is the spiritual realm? Yeah. The, the, the spiritual realm is the invisible realm. Yeah. It's not obvious to the physical eyes. It takes, it always takes uh, the ministry of the Holy Spirit to open your eyes so you can see beyond the physical, uh, you know, physical realm. So mm -hmm. what we have seen today, that's the physical realm. But there is another realm beyond what you are seeing today. Amen. And it is an invisible realm. Amen. But it takes the eyes of the Spirit to see that realm. And that's why sometimes people say, oh, I have seen an angel. So, you know, so some of you, you can relate to what we are saying here. So, and uh, don't, also, it's very easy to see the, spirit, the spiritual realm. And uh, that's why, as you keep listening to this message, I pray mm -hmm. that your spiritual eyes to be open so you can see and understand the things of the spirit. Mm 